Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today it's going to be slightly different. Um, my wife and I are heading down to Frio to hunt down some secondhand books that are going to be very cheap. So we're going to do a challenge and I will tell you more about that a little bit later. Hey guys, so we've finished doing the... Um, hey! Oh yeah, this is my wife. Heather from the Lichen Project. So we chose five prompts initially. In the end we ended up swapping out two of those prompts because it was just almost impossible to find books that match those prompts. So in the end we went with a tome. So what was the tome that I'm going to be reading my love? It is Ancient Future The Dark Age by Tracy Harding which is a book one in a series. Look at that. She's gonna hate me for this. I got her cross stitch. <laughs> okay, by Diana Gabaldon. This this guy, Diana Gabaldon. Um, has this has been redone as Outlander, the book, the TV and thing. But this is my mum read this initially, so I know the story. Um, so it's gonna be interesting. I do like I've watched the TV and I want to kick Claire in the bum. <laughs> but anyway, moving on. What's your next prompt? And in the title, so this is one of the ones we swapped out for um, another prompt. So I got Heather, Simon and the Oaks, which seems to be a historical fiction based around okay. um, Hitler, <laughs> but okay. Hitler's victims. Okay, interesting. You're going to read Dan Brown's Angels and Demons. <laughs> um, literally, when we changed it, I was like, ha ha, I have seen this. So it is going there to There was like three or four copies of Angels Copy and of Demons yeah. just in there. And I'm like, I actually wouldn't mind reading that again. So, so when she said that, she's like, I know you've read it. I'm like, I wouldn't mind reading yeah. it again. So we were trying to find books that she hadn't read, but um, it's the first one that popped to mind. And I was like, I'm not scouring it because it's a huge bookshop. So that's yours. Next so I'm gonna is... Just... <laughs> you need to come into the frame, darling. <laughs> My arm was getting sore, sorry. sorry. Uh, next prompt is no animals or humans on the cover. So I got Heather Adam Brown, Digital Fortress. <laughs> <laughs> oh, go Dan Brown. Now, the question is, is this number three? Um, no, that one doesn't fit into the series. It's okay. a standalone. That's fine. I, um, I'm taking a wild swing here um, because you don't read thrillers a lot. But I went with Gillian Finn's Dark Places. Um, it just has like some bits on the bottom. Um, it's the author of Gone Girl, so have fun. All right. Next prompt was a person on the cover. And for that, Charlene Harris is Dead Until Dark. Which is the True Blood novel. First book in the book. True Blood series. I got, I have no idea about this one. It is Oblivion by Josephine Hart. It's a really short book, so I thought we'd try it out. See how that goes. Thank you. And the last prompt was Australian author. And for this, I got Heather a really short poetry book. Ooh, by Andrew Patterson's Poetry. So it's by Margaret. Okay. Mother old, but it's by Sandra Patterson okay. wrote the poems. I went with the YA dystopian Tomorrow When the War Began by John Marsden. So, yeah. oh, I was looking for that for you. Found <laughs> it. That was about the only copy they had. Woo! Um, so we will let you know how this goes. Bye. See you guys later. <laughs>